Hello guys and welcome back to the Crazy Minecraft video where today Marco Friendly Zombie has gone ahead and invited us for a wonderful challenge where last night he stayed up trying to fabricate some brand new golems and he needs our help to go ahead and see if they work. Well, let's go see what he's given us today and hopefully we can help him out. So he's gone ahead and given us an iron sword, a few breads and a wonderful book that says Hello Naveed, we are running out of time. In five minutes, there will be a zombie apocalypse, and only you can save us. You must build the strongest golem you have ever constructed to save our houses. Wait, is that why you stayed up all night? Okay, it seems like Marco from the zombie knew there would be a zombie apocalypse, but he's only just told us, and it seems like he needs our help now to go ahead and construct some brand new golems. So he's given us loads of obsidian, loads of iron, and loads of stones, so I'm going to go in and figure out what to do with these. Now, I did see he pretty much put them all inside a very unusual formation, something sort of like this. I think very quickly we should be able to build this golem. Mark, was it like this? Now, I wasn't sure if there was another layer, but I'm guessing because we have the blocks, there must be. Okay, but I'm going to need some sort of dirt. I won't be able to reach the top. Now, I'm guessing this is the only way we can go ahead and do this. If I pretty much start building up, and perfect, and now we add these blocks. One, two, three, four, and five. Did anything happen? Mark, <laughs> I think it's broken. Oh, wait, he did give us some creeper hairs. Here we go. Whoa! Okay, it seems like he's gone ahead and made a colossal golem. This is awesome. And I'm pretty certain we should be able to right click. Can we write it? Yes, <laughs> we can. This is perfect. Watch out, Mark. It's going to be awesome. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Now, stop it, Mark. I have to kill you. Okay, this is turning out to be such a crazy day. Mark, a funny zombie, got really upset because this colossal golem pretty much hurt him. Well, Hopefully this is the start. So what I'm going to do is go ahead, take out back these dirts, and perfect, and let's go and build the next one. So we know what it looks like now. So we're going to do two on the ground, three on top, then let me go up one block, and then we do five like this, and perfect. And then we add another block of iron right here, and then we go up two more blocks, and then we go ahead and do the last layer. Mark, what do you think, my friendly zombie? I think this is going to be awesome. Whoa! <laughs> we have a suit of a colossal iron golem. Can we ride this one? Now, as far as I can see, I don't think we can. Oh, yes, we can! This is perfect! Okay, this time, I'm not going to hurt Marco for any zombie. I'm just going to leave them be. I think so far, they both look awesome. And let's not forget to go ahead and do the final one. So I'm going to go in and add uh, the two cobblestones, and perfect, as well as the next layer. And then another layer to go ahead and do the shoulders. And let's not forget the final layer on top. Here we go. And let's go see what this one's going to look like. So far, every single one has been super cool. Yes, we have another one. The stone colossal golem. This is perfect. Well, I don't think I'm going to need this dirt anymore. So let's go ahead and put all of this back before Mark of the Zombie gets really upset. Can we put them there? And perfect. Mark, I think this is awesome. But I do want to figure out how well these would do in some sort of zombie apocalypse. So guys, let's wait for the zombies and let's go see what's going to happen. Mark has just alerted us that the first wave should be here. And wait, I think there are. Okay, let's jump on our golems. Come on. And perfect. And let's go and do this. Yes. <laughs> We should be able to go ahead and fight them off. So it seems like we have everything from nether zombies to knights to even zombie miners. Oh, and there's a zombie cyborg. Okay, I want to see what these golems do by themselves. <laughs> okay, we got to get out of here. It seems like the knight one and the cyborg one are trying to follow us. Help us out, iron golem. We need your help. These colossal golems seem to be a little bit of a waste of time. This stone one doesn't even want to work. <laughs> okay, let's go and do this. Thankfully, our obsidian one is doing a great job. But he is taking his time as well, which maybe might be bad news for us. Keep going and perfect. Come on, we need to do this. Now, somehow, he's managed to go ahead and get the cyborg one stuck. Keep going, and perfect. We only have two more to go and do. But I do know that we have still so many more golems to go ahead and spawn, and so many more zombies to go and kill. Yes, it's working! Okay, are we good? 
The only zombie I see is mark off any zombie and then a minor zombie, which I'm pretty certain we should be able to go and kill. Where is he? Aha, uh -huh, there he is. For some reason, the obsidian one isn't very smart. He doesn't seem to be able to go and do this. Come on, keep going. I'm perfect. I think we've done it. Now, wherever these zombies came from, I don't think there's any more. So, guys, I think we're ready to go ahead now and spawn the next few golems. Mark, I'm totally ready. Let's go and do this. I'm actually pretty excited to figure out what the next few are going to be. So, Mark has gone ahead and given us some dispensers. As well as, let me think, we have some more items. So, let me take out all of these and good. As well as the diamonds. The fences, the nether, as well as the gold, the iron, and the pumpkins. I'm pretty certain all of these are going to go ahead and make something very unusual. Let me put up one, two, three, and four. And then I did see them in sort of like this formation inside the chest. And perfect. And then the dispenser's right on top. So let me do this one first. And good. And yes, it's made some sort of weird turret. Okay, this is awesome. And... Nope! <laughs> Wrong spot. Okay, let's get this back. There we go. Awesome. Wait! Oh, we didn't get it back. That is awful. Now that means we have less turrets than before. Thankfully, the Obsidian Golem, though, has got the memo. Let me go ahead and upgrade every single one, and let's go and do the Netherrack one. But sadly, we only have three of them. So let's do this, and perfect. Let's make sure we don't mess up this time. And good. And there we go. And then the final one... Yes, we've done it. Okay, I think so far we've done a great job. But I do want to figure out if we can use any of these items we've left behind. So let me take out every single one. Nope, doesn't work. Oh, wait. I think it does seem to work, but it makes something very unusual. Okay, I can throw these back then. And let me go ahead and get out the next few items. For some reason, they've gone ahead and given us... 32 blocks of iron so i'm pretty certain we have to go ahead and put them in formation and yes it's awesome so it goes ahead and makes a suit of armor of whatever type we put down but we still have so many of these to do so do you know what i'm just going to go ahead and put these down and we're going to wait for night time for the first set of zombies i think we should be fully protected well, guys, I got some crazy news. It seems like all of the zombies have now appeared. And every single one of them have different features. But for some reason, they don't seem to be fighting against our wonderful turrets. What's going on? I thought they're here to save us. Okay, this is not good. Help us out, guys. <laughs> this is crazy. Maybe we can go ahead and get one of these creepers to blow up. Perfect. Okay, so far, nothing seems to be working. I thought they were here to save us. I'm going to have to go ahead and get our wonderful Colossal Golems. Maybe they're the only creatures that can go ahead and save us right now. Here they come. Let's go see what's going to happen. Come on. <laughs> now. Okay, we have to jump on top and let's go and stop these guys. Perfect and good. Thankfully, we do have these Colossal Golems. If it wasn't for these guys, we'll be totally dead right now. Keep going. Come on. We have to do this. We are so close to finishing. Okay, this is absolutely crazy. Thankfully, none of our golems have died. But it's actually such a shame that I don't think we have any sort of features right now. I thought the turrets were here to save us. But as far as I can see, we're totally alone right now. Is he going to do anything? Oh, okay, maybe he is. Nope, <laughs> he's definitely left us alone. Well, I think maybe we have no choice but to go ahead and wait for normal zombies to appear. Maybe they just don't like this kind. Okay, let's drag the zombie over and let's go and see what's going to happen. Actually, whilst we wait, we could go ahead and spawn some more of these guys. Yes, it is working. So it seems like we have to be in charge of going ahead and fighting off the different types of zombies. And then all of these turrets will go ahead and save us from the normal kind. Do you know what? Maybe I can get Mark up for new zombie to get us some spawners so we can pretty much test them all out. What's that, Mark? Oh, you've done it for us? Thank you! You are perfect! Okay, let me show you guys what happens when we go ahead and spawn hundreds and hundreds of these zombies. There we go! All our turrets are finally working. I was wondering why nothing was happening, but it just seemed like they just didn't like the different types of zombies. Well, let's go ahead and spawn all of these. And perfect! Let's just keep spawning! Even if we die, I think we should be alright. Keep going! No! But we've spawned 64 of these guys! <laughs> this is crazy! Get him! 
Whoa! They're shooting so many arrows. And as far as I can see, they're even trying to attack the turrets. But they've killed them off super quick. Do you know what? These guys have been absolutely awesome. But the amount of arrows they've wasted has pretty much destroyed our whole world. Okay, I think we've done a great job. But I could do with some more different types. Okay, I'm going to have to ask Mark and Funny Zombie to keep on constructing more types. Mark, this is perfect. But do you know what? Every single one of these golems could do with more types. Imagine having a diamond one. It will be perfect. Or an enderman one. One that teleports around and destroys everything in your sight. Die, evil creeper, die. Actually, let's see what happens. <laughs> I think because we're so high up, he can't even touch us. Yes, this is awesome. I can live on this guy. Well, guys, it's been super fun today going ahead and fighting off every single type of these monsters. But I'm pretty excited that these turrets have fully protected us. So, guys, don't forget to go ahead and comment down below which one is your favorite. It would be really awesome if you guys could go ahead, subscribe down below, and press the notifications bell. So, guys, I will see you all soon. Peace out. And now I have a dancing golem party. So, see you all soon.